In this video I'm going to show you which tools I mostly use on my carpet repair jobs. First, I'll show you what I use to do most of my carpet patches or pet damage repairs. I was using my Black & Decker steam iron, accompanied with regular seaming tape. But an awesome friend of mine, Christian, bought me a cool glide to use, so I've really been into that. Along, of course, with the Cool Glide tape, different iron, different tape. I use a smooth roller as opposed to the star roller. I use a commercial row finder for loop pile carpet. A cushion back top cutter, Crane 301, really amazing tool. Of course, some better tools blades, better than Persona. A framing square, you can probably tell I need a new one. And of course, my pouch with my stair tool, scissors, pliers, and an Orcon carpet knife. And that's pretty much it for what I use to do carpet repairs most of the time. Now for my carpet stretching tools, if there's furniture involved, I'll use my Lift Buddy, as well as furniture sliders. But if there's no furniture, I'll just use my pouch again with the same tools inside. A kicker just for small areas and for adjusting the power stretcher. And this awesome tool, the Easy Tuck by Taylor Tools. And of course, I'm not going to pull it out, but a power stretcher as well. And that's it for carpet stretching tools. Other tools you may want to pick up would be a pad stapler. A hot glue gun, this is a Crane 204. Definitely a drill with bits, maybe a flathead, Phillips screwdriver. Any kind of hammer, I use a hatchet for the extra weight. A pry bar. Some nails for hammering tack strip. A magnetic nail holder. And of course, some seam sealer. There are more tools you can get, but this is what I mainly use on most of my jobs. And that's what I use on most of my jobs. Everything goes in one of these Husky tool bags you can get at Home Depot. It has a few pockets, but it's just perfect for this. It has straps or handles to carry it. And this is pretty much all I take into a house when I do a job. You don't need to take a garage of tools to do a repair. Just something really simple, and that's what I like. 